me notes, huh? I said they call me notes, huh? That's what they screaming at my shows, huh? Get a pen and take notes, huh? What's going on, family? Welcome to another episode of Sneaker Notes. I'm your guy, C Notes. I want to thank everybody for subscribing, liking, commenting. If you're new to the channel, stay right here. Down below, hit that subscription button so you can stick around and we can talk as a family. You already know how we start the channel off. I want to see, we want to see what you want on foot today while you wore this episode. Today, it's kind of nice outside. I'm just going to go to the park and chill for a little while. So I kept it regular. I got on the blue and white 12s, Jordan 12s. Let's get to that. Yeah, so those are the blue and white Jordan 12s. Those are one of the classic shoes. They come out often. They always sell out when they come out. It's just a good shoe, especially if you're from New York, you wear it with your Yankee or whatever. That's a good shoe. But enough of that. You know what we came to talk about today. Yeezy 500s. So nice, I caught them twice. So let's get into the shoe, man. My life been cozy, but I roll with it. My mind was fine to the dough hit it. He told me that the mold did it. Easy, lush, fine hundreds. Now this time, the deed is easy. They didn't go with the boost. They went with something new called Addy Prime. See if y'all could get that. Addy Prime. So they went away with the boost technology and they're supposed to be more comfortable. Got one little Adidas sign. No really signs of Yeezy on here. So now my honest opinion about these, I'm not gonna go with trash, but they not for me. I brought two pairs because in the picture, it looked kind of better. I mean, you can still throw these down, but this ain't something I, I, I really get into. And speaking of get into with Yeezy, the last two, Yeezy old for two this year, man. Um, Let's cut to a commercial break while I show you the other pair of Yeezy that came out before this. We'll be right back. We'll be right back. And we back. So before these Yeezy 500 Desert Rats came out last Saturday, 
These came out. The Yeezy Power Face. You know these like these Reebok remakes? Yeah, these came out. Now if you ask me, Yeezy, and I know the Yeezy fans are gonna kill me. We go for two, man. Now this, I'ma rock when I get a chance. I'll probably beat these up. Go kick everything, you know what I mean? Beat these up. For $120, this is not a bad bad price for a sneaker. But for these, 200 I could have passed on these. And I brought them twice. I'm not saying I'm not going to wear them because, you know, I got style. I'm going to put something together, but it's, it's not a good snoop sneaker. It's not something I'm dying to put on my feet. So here, you got your Yeezy 500s, here you got your Yeezy Power Face, in the comment section below, let me know if you think like I think, the Yeezy's over for 2 right now for this year, man. These Yeezy's are coming out in a colorway called Yellow Moon, they look like this. So that color might do some justification to this sneaker. I mean, you can't go wrong with just an earth tone. I see the Jordan 14s is coming out of sand and an earth tone color just like this. So maybe it's competition within the two and they just trying to, um, see, I'm really not an earth tone, earth tone guy. The sneakers, the sneakers okay, you know, it, it, got a little accents here that glows up in the dark as I'm looking. It's probably just the color. If this was to come out of all red, all blue, or all green, I might have a different opinion, but the earth tone, it, it, it doesn't do it for me. But in the comment section below, let me know if you cop, if you slap. I'll be back with another video soon. This is just to keep you engaged. As I'm going through real life stuff and I'm doing everything else I could. So in the comment section below, I'm going to see what you want on foot. Please like, share, and comment the page. Other than that, get rich. We interrupt this program to bring you a special report.